Oh, hello. I would like to do a quick little demonstration involving a precipitation reaction. And precipitation reaction takes place when we take two solutions. We have aqueous solutions, meaning in water, some potassium iodide and some lead nitrate. And we're going to form a solid. And that solid is going to have a nice little color to it. You'll be able to see it clearly in the demonstration in a moment. That solid's going to be lead iodide. We have a couple of spectator ions, some K plus and some NO3, indicated by aqueous. These are not going to come together, but they're going to continue to float. I've gone ahead and put forward and reverse arrows here. This system is definitely going to be in equilibrium. Let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the little demo. I have a solution of some lead nitrate, lead 2 plus, Pb2 plus and nitrate, NO3 2 minus, dissolved in water. And in the brown bottle, to protect the iodine, which is photochemically active, light will affect it. I have some potassium iodide, some Ki. So I'll go ahead and put some of these in. This is a very concentrated solution of each. We have one molar, one molar of each. So I'm going to go ahead and mix these in. Let me pour in the uh, lead nitrate, give it a little mix. And I'm not going to mix for this. I'm just going to go ahead and pour in the lead iodide. We have ourselves a yellow solid, a precipitate. And at the moment, it's floating around. And it's also extremely heavy. The lead iodide, lead's heavy, iodide's heavy. So it's going to crash down to the bottom of the beaker eventually. We'll have the yellow powder down at the bottom and the aqueous solution up on top. In the aqueous solution, we're going to have lead nitrate, potassium iodide, and potassium nitrate. So we're going to have our dissolved ions. And down at the bottom of the beaker shortly as it crashes down is going to be the lead iodide. All of this stuff is present at any given moment. A couple of these are getting together, making these. And simultaneously, these are reacting to go ahead and form product over on the right side.